wow, this YouTube Rewind of 2018 is terrible. I, I, I could make something ten times better than this. Hello, I'm Shadow Raccoon, and you may have noticed it's no longer 2018. It's now 2019, so that means I get to say Happy New Year to you. Now, there's been quite a lot of videos recapping 2018, and some of them have been fantastic. Some of them, not so much. I mean, for me, 2018 has been a momentous year. I, I got this lovely new fursuit, um, I moved house, I went to Midwest Fur Fest, I've met loads of really lovely people. Um, obviously, my YouTube channel's a year old now as well. Um, and yeah, but, you know, rather than just go on about how great my 2018 is, I'd rather find out just what your 2018s were like. So, you know, why not find out? Your favourite furry moments from 2018. Hello, my name is Arthur, and I guess if I had to narrow down my uh, highlight of being a furry in 2018, it would be uh, the amount of tea that I drunk, or fuck it, the amount of slippers that I bought. Or, or, or I suppose if I had to be honest and serious about it, it would be spending time with people who I love and care about in America at MFF and, you know, make, making that connection with someone, because that's... That's what's actually important and vital about this fandom, and the best part of it. That, that, that's definitely a highlight in my book any day of the week. Oh, that would make myself feel soppy. Yeah. Hey guys, Esco Jackal here. Hmm, so my favorite furry moment from 2018. On the beginning of the year, I finally had a character made after uh, observing the fandom from a distance for a long time. And that immediately segued into me commissioning a suit for him. And I got that suit uh, just a few weeks before MFF, uh, which was my first con. It's been an incredible year. I haven't been this happy in a long time. And I hope next year is just as good or better as this one. Hola, yo soy Roque y este 2018 en el Furry Fandom ha sido excelente. Conocí muchos amigos y tuve la oportunidad de conocer a uno en persona. Me hicieron muchos dibujos e hice muchos dibujos. Ha sido un excelente año donde amigos han hecho cosas increíbles por mí. Espero todos tengan un excelente 2019. Muy feliz Navidad. Hi, uh, my favorite memories are going to MFF and meeting all the uh, new funny friends I've made over the year. Uh, I would have to say that uh, my mate Got a raccoon, of course, moving in and uh, being able to see him a lot more than I did before. And uh, I would have to say being part of this channel. I really enjoyed making our skits and uh, doing all the reviews and uh, making all you people happy. It's been so much fun doing this and we just want to carry on doing more. Hello, I'm Frio and my most memorable moment of 2018 was a fundraising event at the Vale Wildlife Centre. Vale was a charity of choice at Confuzzle this year and they loved it so much they invited members of the fandom to come and attend their summer open day. A group of us showed up on a really hot day. We had a great time wandering the stores, entertaining folk and collecting donations. We were made to feel really welcome and collectively we raised £480. I also got to meet some great fellow furries and generally terrific people. Hello, Regder here. Um, my favourite furry moments of 2018, as much as I really want to put MFF because it did so much for me and I managed to meet the people that I never thought I'd ever see, um, it's going to have to go to me going to Austria with Theodore Rabbit and Shadow Raccoon for my hatch day um, to see hoopos, actual real life hoopos that are literally my bird self and it was just the most spiritually connecting thing that I've ever experienced and uh, yes, very much, very important memory to me. Hey, I'm Bradley the Scottish Griffin. My favourite furry moment was at the London First Winter Party, singing at the karaoke with my bird brother Red Day. We had some fun and it's fun to sing with people who can sing. For me in 2018, the highlight was mainly the fact that I started actually going to fur meets, which I hadn't done despite being in the community for years, and I have this, which is now attached to my head. Perhaps permanently, I don't know, it's fun! My favourite moment of 2018 has to be when I got this lovely boy, my J-Cell fursuit. Made by the incredible Made by Mercury, aka Hope! And look at him! He's such a lovely boy! 
I love him. Ah. My moment for me of 2018 was when I got approached by BBC Radio Bristol to do a little sit down interview about the very fandom. Um, Basically what happened was a journalist came along to one of the Bristol meets and I think I was the only one who actually started talking to him. Then we exchanged information and then um, we had a little bit of a sit down interview. And I keep saying to myself, maybe I could have done a little bit better, but um, I think it turned out really well. The highlight for me was um, finally going to dance at the um, Winter Pie of all the first it was. <laughs> hey, it's Raspy. And the highlight of 2018 for me was Composuled. In particular, the charity CD we did called Tsunami. Try to get in shot. We raised over £300 and we're hoping to do even better next year. So there we go. Those are some of your favourite furry moments from 2018. I must say, I really want to thank everyone who took part in this video, sent things in. I couldn't feature everything I got, I'm afraid, just because of edit times, etc. But I really appreciate everyone getting involved with this, and it's just been brilliant to watch. So thank you for taking the time to actually record something and send it in. It's been amazing. Um, again, I'd like to thank everyone who subscribed to this channel. Um, it's been a phenomenal year for me. Um, I've got so many things planned the next year, so thank you for subscribing and do stay tuned for the next year. Um, if you haven't subscribed already, click that subscribe button. It's the best way to find out what's on. You know, see more skits from me, more carrot hijinks with Theodore Rabbit. Yay! I want to thank all my patrons for helping support me this year. It's been amazing. I just, yeah, again, it just makes me gush every time. <laughs> just looking at my page. And yeah, seriously, thank you so much for just helping make this channel what it is. Uh, you know, I mean, we've upgraded the camera equipment, I'm getting new lighting very shortly as well, and it's just, uh, you're, you're really helping us out here, so, thank you. Um, again, I can't wait to see what the furry fandom brings in 2019, 2018 was brilliant, um, you know, I've got plans to go to cons, everything else, I look forward to meeting everyone, seeing you all, um, you know, if you see me around, do say hi, there's always hugs available, yay. And yeah, I really do hope that you have some great memories of 2018 yourselves and that you make 2019 an even better year than 2018. So take care, everyone, and I will see you next week. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye! My favourite memory of 2018 was stealing carrots and vegetables from Mr. McGregor's garden! That, that was the film Peter Rabbit. No, I did it! I hope that joke landed. It might not have landed, but it was under 20 seconds. So hopefully, that's gonna work. Like, comment, subscribe. Dab. 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 Another dead jokes that I don't know. I now have to rip off my own hand to turn the camera off. <laughs> I watch. <laughs>